Welcome to Monday Motivation again, where each week we take you through some tips on motivation, mindset and energy management. We're going to do a big one in about 90 seconds to two minutes here. How you optimise your life. How do you get the most out of your life? So people will be holding on tightly here looking for some real fancy tricks and tips and little sneaky, sneaky insights. But the main thing I'm going to say is you have to cut back a lot. You have to cut out the crap basically. One, look at your diet. What's the crap that's in your diet? The unnecessary stuff that's wasting your energy. Cut that out, replace it for something good. Cut it all back at least, yeah? Your exercise, what's the exercise that, that, that you're doing? If you're doing enough that's not serving you that well and how do you replace it for something that's more specific to what you need? If you want to improve your energy, you want to boost your kind of mobility and flexibility, get doing yoga. You know, for instance, rather than doing a boxing session, which might be really good for your fitness and everything else, but it might, might not be giving you the result you want. So be very focused on the result you want and be specific with your training. Thoughts, cut out the crap thoughts, cut out the spiral of negative and critical thinking. Now that takes a lot of work, but the key thing here is you have to be aware of every time you're into negative, critical mode, especially on yourself, but also on others, try and spot it and realize that that is just a spiral. It's a very negative spiral. You'll go down, try and bring yourself back to focusing on your breath, focusing on your body, thinking a positive thought, move on from there. And the next thing is the people and I suppose the activities that you're doing. People and activities that aren't serving you well, no matter how close they are or no matter how much of a habit this activity is, you have to cut them out. You're not going to optimise your life with, uh, with people that are not serving you well and with habits and activities that don't serve you well and don't nourish you. So everything you do should be giving you some kind of nourishment, either physically, mentally or emotionally, and that's how you'll start to optimise your life. And we'll look at further details and that maybe later on in the year as well.